Hey folks, uh, I just wanted to come and share some thoughts. You know, I've been a little quiet on the podcast. So I'll be picking that up soon. Been really uh, building out the business more. Been focusing on, you know, I've got a uh, you know workshop, you know, coming up specifically on healing, you know, uh, trauma, childhood trauma, and uh, PTSD. Right, mine was wartime PTSD, and the point of this is to rocket relationships and quality of life. Well, why? Well, I mean, let's talk about me for a bit. Right. Uh, you know, as I was growing up, well, because of the trauma I experienced, well, I felt like I was the problem. I felt like everything that I did, you know, would you know, amount to something being broken. I felt like I was deserving of what I received. And I and I didn't like it. I hated it. It was, you know, incredibly, you know, destructive in my life which then caused me to then destroy things, right? Alienate people who love me, ruin relationships later on in my life, right? At 19, I ended up joining the uh, joining the army. And by 21, I'm going to my first war zone. And what happened? Well, you know, eight days before I had deployed, well, September 11th happened. And holy cow, was that a crazy time. And so now we've got, you know, my childhood trauma. Now we've got wartime PTSD added on top of that. And things were just rough. I mean, it was incredibly rough. And then, you know, later on, a couple of years later, not not even, you know, fully two years later, then I go to, uh, you know, Iraq, actually not even a year later, right? Because I came back, uh, you know, March, April, yeah, April 2002. By January 2003, we're, you know, we're deploying to Kuwait. And so now I'm seeing things that I can't unsee. Second war zone hasn't even been a year to decompress from the first one. The first one was on the heels of September 11th. And, you know, I ended up ruining two marriages. You know, I, you know, in between those two marriages, you know, I fell in love again and ended up ruining that. You know, I couldn't help but alienate people. Couldn't help but be triggered by my trauma. Got really involved in politics and couldn't help but just be manipulated by my trauma. You know, the media would say, oh, my God, look at this. And then my trauma, that hurt little boy. Well, I, I need to, you know, I, I found, a, found that I was reacting and not responding. I had no ability to respond. I had no ability to know who I was. I was looking to other people to tell me who I was because I was, it was such a foreign idea that I could look within because I look within and there's a bunch of chaos, a bunch of darkness, a bunch of grossness. It took me a long time to be able to heal. You know, after getting out of the army in 2003, it took over 15 years to really find a path to start leading me, you know, out of that darkness. And, but boy, did I get let out of that darkness. And it's incredible. I can go to sleep happy. I can choose to be happy when I want. I can choose to, you know, just allow my emotions to, to make me feel good instead of being controlled by them, instead of losing sleep every night, beating myself up. And what I plan on, you know, doing with this, uh, you know, this workshop, right, this free training I'm putting on on August 30th at uh, 7 p.m. Eastern time, 4 p.m. Pacific time is helping people understand, you know, how, how can they quiet the noise, right? How can we quiet all that chaos that doesn't serve them, that distracts them from, from all the meaningful relationships, from what's actually important in their life so they can focus on that, right? How do we transform that, that voice? That's like the, you know, the, you know, feeling like you're your own worst enemy. Then alchemize that and transform that into being your own best supporter, your own best champion, right? I may not be able to snap my fingers and poof, right? Because the healing that I do, that many of you know, well, it's through meditation, and this is not going to be a, a meditation session. This is meant to be going through and give you, you know, uh, tools for the left brain, for the left brain to operate with. Because here's the thing, right? When I closed my eyes, I saw chaos. Well, where was there room to meditate if there's nothing but chaos? And so what this is, is this is a stepping stone in order to get to that meditation. And so you might already be pretty advanced and already know how to meditate, but even still, right? If we are meditation, you know, champions, we might still find that there's some old paradigms, some old programs that we run in our lives that don't really serve us. And so what this is going to do is going to give you some tools in order to really give you powerful tools, accessible tools, actionable, most importantly, actionable steps that you can take in order to be able to uh, to move forward in life and feel better and feel stronger and to you know be able to achieve the goals that you want. And you'll see in the video description below that I'll have a link to the registration. So you can go ahead and register for this. If you know anyone, you know, who you feel can benefit from this, right? Who uh, you feel could, uh, you know, really, you know, use, you know, th those helping tools, you know, hey, mean the world to me if you could share, because look, 
I was in the world of darkness for so long. I hurt so many people around me. Why? Because hurt people hurt people. And now that I'm healed, the fact that I can you know pay that forward and heal people, right? Because I've hurt people turn around and hurt people will heal people turn around and heal people because we interact from our frame of the world. And it would mean the world to me to be able to heal more people. And if you could you know, share that with people who are hurting, who could use the help, that, that'd be amazing. I'd really appreciate it. Because look, I wasn't born special, right? I'm, I'm just... I'm just a regular person. And here's the thing is that, you know, my healing wasn't because it was like, Eureka, here I am with a special DNA and this special body. No, it's only because I met the right mentors and I had the ability to believe. That's it. You know, because it's not what you learn. Because right? anyone can learn anything from a Udemy course. Doesn't mean that you can execute it very well. Right? Anyone can learn how to play basketball on the streets. Doesn't mean you're going to be an NBA champion. Because it's not about what you learn, it's who you learn it from. And, you know, I'd love to be able to you know, give an opportunity to help heal those you love. Because that's why I'm putting this on. Heal those I love, right? Love the world. Love, you know, as, as many people as I can. Help them climb out of the darkness. Find a better way. Find a better life. And uh, really appreciate your support. Thank you, everyone. You're amazing. And uh, may love and truth always guide your path. Oh, and uh, again, a reminder... You know, the workshop's going to be on August 30th at 7 p.m. Eastern time, 4 p.m. Pacific time. And you'll see the link again in the uh, in the uh, details. Thanks so much. Take care.